the forehead of your robot. I have been a fan of SML for quite a while, as I enjoy all of their content. If you don't know, SML, or Super Mario Logan, is a plush puppet channel created by logan 38 er along with his brother Lens, all the way back in 2007. They received a cease and desist letter from Nintendo in 2021, as Nintendo didn't seem to like their content, and they were forced to delete his first channel which had 10 million subscribers, as well as their second channel, Super Luigi Logan, SLL. But enough of that, I am going to tell you about an SML episode that heavily altered my view of SML ever since. I was watching YouTube, when a notification for a new SML video showed up on my screen. The episode was titled, The Feast, and the thumbnail showed Chef PP holding a knife, and the word feast was in red. I thought nothing of it, as I thought it would just be Chef PP cooking terrible food as he usually does. So I began watching the video. The video begins with Chef PP cooking tons of food in a rush. Braxton then walks in. Is the food ready yet, Chef PP? Braxton asked angrily. Not yet. I'm still working on it, boss. Chef PP said. Well, hurry up. Braxton said, when he then slapped Chef PP. Chef PP just let out a big moan of anger, as he continued to cook the food. The scene then cuts to Junior and his friends. So guys, what do you want to do today? Junior said. I don't know you, said Joseph. Do you guys want to go mess with Chef PP? Junior asked them. His friends both say yes, and they go to the kitchen. Chef PP was taking a little break from cooking. Get in! Said Junior. Then they all jump on Chef PP, biting him, like they did in the restraining order. They did this for a while before running away giggling. Chef PP was pissed now. God damn those fucking kids! I'm tired of those stupid fucking rats always getting on my fucking nerves! Chef PP said in extreme anger. I was honestly shocked, yet at the same time, laughing at this. He turned to the food and then got a horrific idea. Then the video takes a turn for the worst. He picked up a knife and walked towards the camera. It then went back to Junior and friends. They were laughing at what they did. Chef PP appeared behind them. Chef PP then quickly grabbed Junior and took him behind the couch. Junior! Cody said. Chef PP then cut Junior's head off. Realistic looking blood came out. I was very disgusted by this scene. Cody and Joseph looked behind the couch to see only Junior's body, with Chef PP already gone, and blood pouring on the ground. Dude, what happened? Joseph asked. I don't know. Cody said. The lights then go out. What happened to the lights? Cody asked. Maybe someone just turned the lights off. Joseph said. Let's go turn them back on. They walk over to the light switch, and try to turn on the lights. It didn't work. Cody said anxiously. A shadowy figure slowly approached behind them. I couldn't identify who the shadowy figure was. Suddenly, the lights came back on. Cody and Joseph turned around, to see Chef PP holding a bloody knife, with blood on his face. Chef PP? Joseph said scared. Chef PP was about to slash Joseph, but Cody pushed Joseph out of the way, sacrificing himself to save Joseph. Cody got cut in half. Cody! Joseph said terrified. You're next. Chef PP said in a distorted voice. Joseph ran away, as Chef PP chased after him. Joseph tried to look for a phone to dial 911. He saw Junior's phone lying on the couch. He tried to run to it, but Chef PP appeared in front of him. Good night, Joseph. Chef PP said, before the screen goes black. All that can be heard is Joseph screaming. The scene then cuts to the dining room. Chef PP was finishing setting up the dinner table, with all the food and everyone. Braxton, your dinner's ready! Chef PP calls out. Braxton walks downstairs to eat the food. The scene showed something I will never forget. It showed Junior's severed head, half of Cody's body, and Joseph's heart. There was also the normal food that Chef PP cooked in the beginning of the video, but there was a red liquid poured on all of them, presumably blood from the three kids. 
Braxton was horrified, and I understand, I was too. Oh man, that cheat. Chef PP said. The video ends with an SML question that reads. What would you do if Chef PP was your chef? The childish music that usually plays was replaced by dark distorted piano music, followed by fearful ambience. After a while of being public, the video was taken down by YouTube, as of the violence and the gore. After watching that, I tried to tell others about the video and my experience, but nobody seemed to believe me, or even care at this point. They don't know about the video, because it was taken down. Then I tried to go to sleep, but that SML video haunted me and left me unanswered questions, and I couldn't fall asleep that night.